Hey guys, this is David with Great Choice Audio Video. Hey, today's video is about Lutron shades. Uh, we do a lot of shades, uh, motorized shades, uh, in a lot of homes these days. And we built this demo. Um, it's a demo window showing two different types of shades uh, that we could do in, in somebody's home. Uh, now these are wired shades. Now uh, all the shades we do here in this demo is from Lutron. Now Lutron does offer a total wireless shade uh, for, so, for someone who didn't wire for a shade um, uh, called the Triathlon. But we have the Roller 64 and we have the Dual Shade Roller 100. And so this is a typical uh, 2x6 construction um, and two separate windows. And this, this again, this is just a demo. Uh, for our showroom uh, and I'm going to show you guys uh, some differences on using one over the other. Now I know there's a lot of different brands on the market and we run across across um, several different brands or competitive brands and and one of the reasons why we use Lutron is because the quality of the products they have super super quiet motors they're great long warranty eight-year warranty and their ability when you're doing multiple windows in a row uh, right next to each other, two, three, four windows in a row. Their, their ability to have perfect hem bar alignment. So when you're raising and lowering them in one, you, you, let's say you got a big wide open space with a whole bunch of windows and they're all motorized and you want to hit all of them down or all of them up, it's really nice to have them all go up or down at the exact same time where I've seen other manufacturers they're all a few inches from each other and they're all much, much louder. Warranties aren't as good. So um, you do get a little bit of what you pay for. Um, yes, um, Lutron's more on the middle, higher end, but uh, again, guys, such a great product, uh, especially if we're working with third-party companies for control, uh, but these also work great as a standalone product. So in this right window, uh, we have the Roller 64. Uh, again, it is wired. Um, both these shades are, but it has a wireless communication device. Now, I have it shown here as an open roll, just so you guys can see, um, you know, the type of shade it is. This is a, um, it's like a sunscreen shade, um, but uh, it allows lots of light to come through, and it also um, has less in the privacy department. So, unlike a blackout shade, it's going to be total solid. So what's really nice about these shades is the different form factors and how you can control them. You can control them with an app. You can control them with a simple, what they call Pico remote. Pico remotes, if you guys are familiar, are just a wireless remote. If you can see that guys. And these wireless remotes can be placed anywhere. So they make a little tabletop. So it easily slides, if you can see that, slides into place. And you got your raise, lower, you have a favorite, which is usually 50% button in the middle, and then you know all the way up, all the way down. Um, super easy control. You, and because this is wireless, you can place this anywhere that you want it to be. So um, you, th there's actually a trim kit. Um, let's say you have a, a bank of light switches um, that are decor style by the, by the door. You can easily, with the bracket, put this right next to it like it was supposed to be there, um, and then put your faceplate over it, and it looks nice and clean. Uh, no wires necessary. This battery is going to last for many years, and you're able to locally control the shades. Super, super easy, guys. So let's uh, let's get these uh, different shades out um, where they're operable, and I want to show you guys some differences uh, between the two, and let you listen to the motors and how quiet they are. So let's get to it. All right, guys. So the Roller 64 here on the right. Pico remote, we're easily control hitting the shade to go down. And just like that, easily goes down. And we've already gone in and selected the lower limits and upper limits. But I'm going to raise it and I want to stand right by the shade and see if you could even hear it go up. Because this is a big noticeable difference between Lutron shades and a lot of other shades. Just the amount of noise a shade uh, has. These shades are super quiet, very low decibels. So I'm going to raise the shade.
Did y'all hear it? Super low. <laughs> it's crazy how quiet the motors are in these shades. Um, and then if you want, you know, you, you have your exact points of, of, you know, lower and raise. And then you want 50%, you just hit this middle button right here. And then go down to 50%. And again, guys, if you had multiple shades next to them, you could group them together, still with one button press, and be able to raise and lower. So as you can see, this is what I mean. And then the dual shade, I'll show you guys even a better example of, you know, a light filtering sunscreen type of shade compared to a blackout shade. Now, on this side, it's to the extreme. So um, you can do a blackout shade and it's going to block all the light except typically around the edges and, and, and depending on your trim you may have an eighth of an inch or a little more around the edges of the window. But if you want to make sure that there is no light gaps whatsoever then you could do like we did here in this demo and do these uh, tracks. So the shade actually goes in the track. So what we did, we have another Pico remote but this one's different because this is a dual shade and you have this piece here. Now again, on, on this 64, we can add different types of fascias from metal to uh, fabric wrapped. Um, we have a lot of options there for, for custom fascias um, or open roll um, if you want to see the roll itself. But on this dual shade, again, custom colors for the, uh, the, all the metal pieces that go in front. It could be fabric wrapped. Uh, but let's do first shade. And it's the blackout. And as you see, guys, it's going inside the tracks. So with that window that was behind there, you can see there's zero light whatsoever because of these pockets. And again, I'll raise it. You can barely hear it. And you only heard it because it goes through this pocket because it's going against all these bristles. But what a nice clean fit and finish. But that's, that's, not the, that's not the only cool part about this. Being a dual shade, you get the best of both worlds. So let's close the shade. But this time, it's we want some light to still come through but have a little bit of privacy. So we go with this one. And then we could raise it. I don't know if you noticed, but see how smooth that is and very little noise. So a lot of great options with Lutron, you know, from the different widths we could do, heights, dual shades, with pockets, without pockets, different types of fascias, metal, fabric, open roll, um, from the Roller 64s, the Roller 100s, or total wireless shade uh, with a triathlon. We have a lot of solutions using Lutron, whether it's um, third-party systems that we're controlling it, easy controls with Pico remotes, whether it's a tabletop version or on the wall, lots of good options, guys. So if you have any questions, comments, leave them in, in the in down below this video. And uh, we'll hope we see you guys on the next one. Until next time. Thanks, guys.